Hi there. So, have you ever wondered why your Find My is not showing you the location, and it says no location found on iPhone or iPad? Well, look no further. In today's video, I'll show you exactly how to solve no location found in Find My app on iPhone. Well, in order to solve these problems, you actually want to take a look at the few settings on your phone. First of all, on your iPhone or iPad, you gotta head over to Settings, select Apple ID, and tap Find My. Especially if you are using the same Apple ID, but you are not enabling the Find My and these important settings, Find My Network, and send my last location. This is very important. If you disable these two, it will never reveal the location from your device. At the very same time, you wanna go back here and then scroll down and simply select this option called privacy and security. Once you come to these settings, you need to scroll down again and simply find out your Find My. So first you gotta select a Google location here and now find out the Find My here. If it says or set to never, this the same thing will happen to you as well so make sure to select while using this app and always enable the precise locations after that just simply get out of here and restart your iphone now most likely after following this your problem is going to be solved however if you still have problems check out the last two process which will definitely work for you no matter whether you're using an iphone or ipad Next, you gotta head over to settings again. This time you need to scroll down and find out your screen time. If you come to your screen time, scroll down and tap content and privacy restrictions. If you are putting certain restrictions to your Find My, then it will give you the same problems. So make sure to disable the content and privacy restrictions, then go back here and open up your general and always look for the last software update. If your iPhone has offering you the new software update on your device just go ahead and update it and after that check your problems now after following all of that your problem is going to be solved however if you still have a problem there are two things you have to worth looking at first your internet and second the default setting for your iphone so you can of course open up your browser and try to browse through your youtube app or you can go to youtube just to see it's actually loading up or not or you can simply go back to your settings scroll down to the general and then scroll down to tensor and reset iphone and here select reset and choose restore all settings now even though it will reset all of your you know changed settings back to default but sometime doing this you will actually remove the box and glitches from your device and it will solve your problem at the same time still have questions about this problem please let me know in the comment section to get further help see you guys around